Hi there! I'm Knitting Phi by the Knitting Vortex and it's a super lovely shawl pattern. And it has long colorways and unless you want ends, you know, every time, um, the best thing to do is carry the color some way along the side. So Jennifer, who's the Knitting Vortex, has a great tutorial for how to do this, um, but I'm really, really picky. <laughs> and so, um, and also I noticed in her sample she's using a gray and a green that both have blue undertones, whereas my colors are much more contrasting. So when I tried that technique, it's subtle, this isn't going to bother everyone, but you can see on the right side there is um, a little bit of the carry happening. And so I worked on a different technique so that I could have the carry minimized on the right side. So if you'll see what I did, um, it's very hard to see um, the carry on the right side here. Now on the wrong side you will um, certainly see something much more pronounced. So I'm just going to show you what I did. Um, I don't think that this is better or anything. Um, it actually does, my way of doing it does leave a more pronounced carry on the wrong side. Um, but I think it's less pronounced on the right side. So I'll just show you what I did. And it's just throwing it out there as a technique you can use. I think it's something you'd be able to use um, with lots of different patterns because basically you're just um, doing a wrap around the stitch. So here I am, I'm on the wrong side um, and I'm following the instructions to do an increase on the last stitch. Okay, and up to this part, this is exactly what Jennifer has recommended. So you'll take the yarn that, that you're carrying and put it through onto the other side as you do your knit front and back. Okay, and that's what leaves your carry on this wrong side. Now I'm going to turn my whole piece around and here's, I'll show you what is different. So I'm going to knit my first stitch. And then as I increase in this next stitch, I'm going to knit through the front loop. Okay, it's a knit front and back increase. And then I'm going to take this yarn that I'm carrying and bring it to the back as I knit through the back loop. Okay, so I'll go ahead and get a stitch or two past it so you can see what this does. So what it basically does, and you can see a little hint of the yellow here, is it does a wrap around one of the stitches. And so I'm keeping the yarn from um, wrapping along the side which is what makes it visible on the right hand side of your work and it's making a carry along the back side of the work so it's something I think you could use try out on different patterns and it's just a little tip I think I would thought I'd share